Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. This is Diogo for Gearspace.com and today I would like to show you Area 33, the latest SDX expansion for Superior Geometry by Toontrack and this one is all about metal. So this video is meant to be a companion for my written review. You can find the link for that down in the description and this is how things are going to play out. First, I have a full-blown production with guitars, bass, vocals, everything, some mixing going on so you can hear the Area 33 sounds in a proper context. Then I'm gonna give you a quick breakdown of the new cymbals, new drums, new snares, new mics, new everything. Then I'm going to play you some solo drums. All right, so without further ado, let's get this rolling.
Okay, so from bottom to the top, let's start with the kick drums. We have 14 kick drums to choose from. Plenty of unique stuff here. Chrome, stainless steel, fiberglass, many cool options. And this time around, we have two kick drums. I only have a single one loaded here because I was running into RAM issues. You know, the kit's quite big. I have to run Pro Tools screen capture software, the whole 90 yards, so only a single kick drum for me. And I only needed one sound, so not much of a point for me in this particular song, of course. Here is the second kick drum. So in case you would like to have two kick drum sounds, now you can, which was not an option on the Superior Hedoma 3 bass library. Okay, moving on to the snares. We have 13 snare options. Once again, lots of variety here, different sizes and materials, very cool stuff. Toontrack has been doing an amazing job on snares. They're doing an amazing job on the whole thing, of course, but his snares are particularly awesome on Superior Drummer and with Area 33 is not any different, so 13 snares. Okay, so let's move on to the toms. We have five slots for rack toms and three slots for floor toms. So three options here for the small tom, three more here. Here it starts to get interesting. We have seven options. Then once again, seven options. Oops. Four options here. Seven options here once again. Seven options one more time and four options for the big floor tom. Okay, so now to the symbols. Let's go from left to right, starting with the hi-hat. Uh, three options, uh, two 15 inches, which is cool. Here we have two chinas, one small china, which sounds really nice, and a big 20 inch china. Here we have some effects, we have a power bell, we have a stack with two trash hits from Stambul, and another stack with a mini china and a custom metal splash from Paiste. And now here we have four crashes. So three options here, three more options here, three more options here, and two options here. Then we have another effect symbol slot with three splashes and one stack. Here we have three big crashes, 20 and 22. Another big, huge crash here, 24 inch. It's important to note that for this 24 and for the 20 and the 22, you will only have the crash articulation. So you cannot use them as a, like a regular ride symbol because you don't have the tip of the stick articulation here. Down here, we have more effects. Uh, a splash, a trash hit, and a stack. Here we have three chinas. Here we have the actual ride symbols for Area 33, three options. Then we have four more crashes here, quite big too. Here we have a another bell. It's a, it's a different one from, from the left side here. Uh, this one is from the Hand Hammer uh, by Sabian. And this one is a custom shop by Sabian. And last, oops, it's mirroring, you know, because I don't have anything loaded here. It will trigger <laughs> all the way across the kit. And last but not least, three very cool China symbols to choose from. Okay, so this is the kit. I'm going to show you the mixer. Uh, the mixer is completely empty because I did all my mixing in Pro Tools here on the right side. Uh, the cool thing about this uh, set of mics for Area 33 is that we have stereo mics now for the kick, for the toms, for the snare, uh, for the hi-hats, and we also have plenty of new room mics as well. Uh, I have a, a, a picture which I'm going to show you right now that's also uh, in my review, so you can check out all the available options for room mics. Uh, I, I have a bunch of mics hidden here because, you know, 
there's there are 45 mics and I was not using everything so I only have the ones that I'm actually using here along with the outputs if you like this kit I have the preset file you can find the link also in the description so make sure to check that out all right so on the Pro Tools mixer I don't have much going on it's very basic I think this is one of the easiest uh, set of kits to work with because they, they actually don't need that much of processing to be honest so I have my channels here I'll highlight those for you so I have kicks snare uh, a shared stereo channel for the hi-hat and ride uh, one for the toms cymbals overheads and drum room uh, for the kick I have a Poltec and my dear metric halo EQ for the snare I have the arouser and once again my metric halo EQ and for everything else I only have the metric halo channel strip going on and I would also like to to set up a parallel uh, uh, bus uh, with a really aggressive compressor this time around it's the arouser once again so I'm sending some stuff from the kick from the snare and for from the toms uh, I'm not sending any symbol to this bus and then I have a clean bus with only the mics uh, and then I will sum this two up on this third bus here with the Pro C2 um, and the TDR Nova and that's about it so uh, I'm not doing anything fancy anything super advanced I might do in the future once I get like a real project going on because this song will, will, is just meant to, to, to be a demo um, so yeah all right so I'm gonna play you some solo drums now uh, keep in mind that I haven't balanced uh, for this particular solo drums recording so I, I, I just straight up hit the solo button uh, uh, for the drums and that was it so the toms are a bit loud because they, they were sounding good in, in the context of the song but you know that's why we don't mix in solo so any solo stuff stuff gets weird so okay thank you all for watching I hope you like the review I hope you like Area 33 I think it's amazing and all right I'll see you next time bye bye